Hey guys, welcome back. I'm not speaking very loud right now because Bran is sleeping, but I need to get him up. And Caramel, what are you doing? You're making noise. So let's uh, wake up Brian. Time for you to get up. You have to get up, Brandon. It's time. It's your time. Say hello to everyone. Caramel, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? Caramel. Hey, cat. What are you doing here? Yeah. You're exploring? Yeah. You're exploring too much. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah. Hey, Brian. Here's your coffee. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. That's a little. I want it. Okay. Just don't spill it. Hey. What are you doing? Pascal finally succeeded in waking me up. <laughs> it's now, what, 30 minutes later? Yeah. But yeah, I'm still very drowsy, very sleepy. My allergies are back. And I have to force him to wake up because if he if I'm not there, like he can't wake up, right? So yeah, I have to wake up. It's super hot outside and inside. You're super hot. It, what oh thank you. What <laughs> is it like fifty eight degrees? I don't know. Celsius, something around that. No, it's only like 30 degrees, and now, yeah, I have to get up, I have to get ready for my last day of work for the weekend. Hey! What? My birthday's coming up. My birthday's coming up. No, mine's, mine first. And mine after. So, yeah, we have to go do the dishes, get the <laughs> lunch ready, and, uh... Yeah, yeah oh, hope, and by hope, the way, guys, you're gonna witness me cooking this time, because... Next, next, like the, the one episode before, like it was Brian was cooking and now it's gonna be me, right? Because Brian is the chef of desserts and I am the chef of like making good meals. <laughs> <laughs> making a huge mess! No. Gets me pissed off because I'm gonna go clean up right now I, and you haven't even started. Just leave Brittany alone, Brian. Okay. So, fun <laughs> funny thing, before I started filming this, <laughs> Pascal, tell them what happened. <laughs> Ryan is so like, it's such a klutz. He, he dropped the camera on the floor and I had to put to like, come on, go to Yell at me. Yeah, his brand doesn't like fire attention. <laughs> and, then, like, and he finds it so funny when he drops my precious things on the floor and everything. But it's not funny, Brian. You're gonna break him. But I forgive you. <laughs> So now it's still very hot and uh, you have all showered up, you're all cleaned up and I made you breakfast. A nice sangria. Oh, thank you. And now we can go enjoy it on the porch where yeah. mine is already waiting. So are but you coming? But I need to eat a little something. So I'm going to fix myself no. a bowl of pasta first. No, eat my soup. Stop being vulgar on camera. <laughs> so guys, now that we're outside and I'm just enjoying my soup that Bren made me, I just wanted to give you guys an update. Uh, if you're not following me on Twitter, uh, I was um, tweeting the other day that I'm suffering from insomnia and it's been like about two months now that I haven't slept well. Like I'm sleeping at most three to four hours per night because I just can't seem to fall asleep. And yesterday I wanted to see my doctor about this problem and he prescribed me some um, pills and other vitamins to help me get to sleep at night and I tried them yesterday and it worked and I'm so happy I slept for 12 hours and now I just feel so good and happy that's why I tweeted this morning that I felt so replenished and yeah that's, 
just wanted to give you guys an update on this problem, which is not a problem anymore, and I can't be more happy than this about it. Yeah. Eat your soup. I, I'm gonna eat my soup, but it's too hot. Is it? Yeah. Just have a spoonful. I, I, I'm telling you, it's salty. Woo. <laughs> it's good. <laughs> but? It's good, but it's salty. But it's good. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh. Hello. Hello, Chateau. Chacho. Pascal. We have to get the dinner on. Yep, yeah, I'm coming. I'm watching. You better be. By the way, I have a quick poll to ask you guys. I am looking forward to doing something most of you won't like, maybe some of you will not care. I would like to shave my head. No, <laughs> So don't. I need an overwhelming amount of approval in the comments below to let me know if I can do it. Don't. I don't like having hair in the summer. I don't like you if you don't have hair. <laughs> okay, that was pretty blunt but <laughs> honest. Yeah. All right, so. I hate it, I just hate it, because Brian, every summer. Well, I hate your cooking. Okay. I'm ordering some <laughs> bennies tonight. Mm. So yeah, um, what are we doing? We're gonna do um, chicken breasts that are gonna be stuffed with mozzarella cheese and spinach. And what time is it? It's already 3.21, so we better hurry. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to eat this. <laughs> yes, you will. Just open them uh, in half. But don't cut them all the way, like do like like this, so you can fill them later with the mozzarella cheese and the spinach. That's a technique called opening the chicken breasts. Butterfly, <laughs> butterfly, like a butterfly. And these are new knives. They yeah. are the most inexpensive yet effective knives we've. Look buy. at all they cut so perfectly. I'm just gonna wash my hands first because I don't want to get like all the bacteria and the little chicken down in my cheek. Down in my cheese. Yeah. So here's our three shredded mozzarella cheese. Stop moving. <laughs> I was trying. So here's to the mozzarella cheese. It's pre shredded and it's really good. You know, guys. It can't be pre shredded, it's shredded or it's grated, actually. It's pre shredded with me in my world, okay? <sighs> now either step up my level or go away. Okay, so all you need to do is first grab like this amount of cheese and you taste it. Oh, that's gross. And it's pretty good, so you can put it there. So, you just sprinkle, sparkle them like this, as much as you want. You know, when I was a boy, my mom used to make this recipe. Right, you're she, still a boy. A boy is a kid. Uh, and she would add this, with the cheese, spinach, I think, and some ham. Ham would be good, but I feel the chicken is already good enough. Yeah. But it, it added, like, it balanced with the uh, saltiness, saltiness yeah. and the smoky flavor of the forest ham. So. You and your forest ham. Oh. Hello, baby. Danilo. Oh, poor thing. So I feel there's enough cheese. So let's put, let's put the spinach. The spinach. So use the spinach. Don't you have to wilt it first? What do you mean? Put it in the frying pan and wilt it. Why? So it can be smaller? It's gonna, it's gonna get smaller with time, Ren. Just gotta leave it some time. No, just film my dead foot. Ah, what's this? My foot. Get that off the floor. I was filming my toes and I saw that stuff. And yeah, I put it back on the counter. <laughs> I, I put it in a chicken. Uh, here you go. Okay, now, now that that is done, that is done. That is done. You preheat your skillet. Is that how you say it in English? Skillet? Skillet. I'm so skilled in English. Hello, Tisha. Hello. Hey, baby. Ah. And then you just put a little bit of oil in your pan. And that's the oil that we have left. <laughs> yeah. So what are you gonna do? You're gonna see, you're gonna sear the meat and put it in the oven? Yeah, for about like 20, 30 minutes. Yeah, don't do it over the counter at all. And do it over the floor. 
And afterwards, it's gonna be good. All right, see you then. I added some vegetable spices on it just to give it a little bit more flavor. A bit more yum. Yum, and then uh, I preheated the oven at 375 Fahrenheit. And all we have to do now is put them in. They have a nice color, it's a little bit golden. I, I didn't want to cook them too much because I don't want them to be too dry. So all I have to do now is put them in. And it should be ready in about 20 to 30 minutes. Here you go. So it's now 20 to 30 minutes later and I have to leave in like 10 minutes. So Pascal, please get this out of the oven so I can pack my lunch. It smells really good, guys. Oh, it's hot. Yeah. In this million degree weather, it's not a very good idea to have your oven on. It's not a good time to be baking. Look at this beautiful dinner. It's that, There's a lot more water than I expected. Yeah, I think that's the spinach. You think? But, yeah, I don't know. But that looks really good. It smells very it nice. It smells really nice. Hope you nice. can smell it. So this is the end result of our dinner. So it's pretty moist, pretty good. Seems it smells really nice, and I'm just gonna eat this with a side of um, pasta salad we had from another meal, and that's it. So simple yet very delicious. So we're gonna, just gonna make some lunch out of these. I'm gonna keep one for myself tonight, and I guess Brenda needs to get prepared to leave. And I guess we can call it a video, guys. Call it a video. Well, yeah, we can call it a video, a day, a vlog. And I hope you enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. And Please don't forget to vote on my haircut if I should if I should shave my head or not. No, don't shave them. Because like, I love Brian when he has long hair. I'm sure you guys do too. If you don't, just look back at the videos when he shaved his head <laughs> and compare it with now. I just think you look so much more handsome with your hair. So please keep them, Brian. But you never tell me. I, I'm telling you now and okay. I'm telling everyone who's watching. Okay. So guys, thank you for being there. We love you so much. We're gonna see each other next week. And don't forget to comment what you think of our dinner, of our day, and why are you circling around me like a shark? Come on, finish. Okay. Well, it's, it's done, right? It's finished. <laughs> okay. I, I'm, I'm done. Bye-bye. <laughs>